What's going on everyone? My name is Jacob Quarks and welcome to another episode of the Road to Glory career mode I am doing with Barnsley at the moment and I am in such a good mood today. Today is the day the United just beat Liverpool 2-1 at Anfield. What a match that was. Absolutely incredible. It's so good to be a United fan lately. Smashing Tottenham 3-0, going to Anfield, beating them away. I tell you what, I am so happy to be a United fan at the moment. I'm in such a good mood. And uh, I'm recording another episode of the FIFA Grows of Glory series now, so uh, let's go and have a check of our squad report. I don't think I've shown you this in quite a while. Um, but yeah, we've got Spiegel reaching a 70 overall, our first player to reach 70 overall. Unfortunately, he's not a full-time Barnsley player, but yeah, he's 70 overall now. Uh, Elliot Hewitt, I think, will definitely be on the way to a 70 overall within before the end of the season. Craney, not been moving at all. Nyatanga, a little bit, but not really get going anywhere. Tyrone Mings has a bit improving, which is good news for, for us. Aris Mendy's been, well, yeah, you can see it right there. Nothing special. Horahan will be on his way to 70 anytime soon, as will Bailey. Mason's never going to improve. Cole, he could be reaching uh, 67 anytime soon, really. He's just been improving like a beast. Uh, Lisa has been decreasing, of course, he's getting old, he's 31 years old. Uh, Coleman also at 70 overall, but of course, once again, he's plays for Juventus full-time, not for Barnsley. Uh, we've got Paul Digby increasing, uh, Adam Davis increasing, Jennings increasing, although he's unhappy because he wants to leave, and I'm putting him on the transfer list anyway. Uh, Flores increasing, and uh, oh, there's Smith is increasing, nothing really happening around the rest of the board though. Uh, Brown increased by one, Villa's been decreasing, but I haven't played him much at all because uh, Mings has been pretty good. Um, Dibbles increased to 61 overall. Um, yeah, that's basically it. So uh, today we've got our first match of the episode against Wigan Athletic. I can't remember what we. I think we. I think we smashed them like three or four nil last time we played them. I can't remember for sure, but I think we definitely got a, good, a big win on them. Uh, in fact, you know, what, I may as well just check right now. There it is. Yeah, four nil win over Wigan Athletic, as you can see right there. So we did smash them in the last match we played against them, but this time. Well, how have they been? Let's have a look. They're sitting 16th place. They're not doing very well then. And uh, we're doing pretty damn good. So let's see if we can get a good win against them. Let's get straight into it. Yeah, here they go. Oh, he took him. Oh, that was good. Oh, Wigan finding a way through here potentially for sure. For sure. <laughs> I know, that was bad. What, what shit pass that was? Fuck. No, no, they're right through. They're through, it's 1-0 already. Oh my god, what a horrible, horrible mistake there. Oh, that's bad. Oh, that's really bad. Shit. Oh, Bailey. Oh, Cole. Cole, come on. Oh, that was... He's still there. Come on, get to it. Yes! Lita gets the equaliser. That was weird. I don't know, I don't know how Lita got to it and not Cole. But it's one all. Oh, goodness me. That was that was probably not the best shot. Uh, but anyway, Lita gets a nice tap in there in the end. Very scruffy goal outside of the boot. But we're back on level terms now. Hard fought. Thank goodness for that. I thought we were going to lose this match. Sixth goal of the season for Lita. Fantastic. Hewitt, well done. Very good. Oh, very good indeed. Come on, get that to, to Lita. Oh, he's too slow. Someone do something here. Come on, Bailey, well done. There you go, give it to Lita. Lita's got the strength to hold it off, has he? Yes, he does. I don't know what we're going to do here, though. There we go. Oh, gone to Mings. Mings, oh, he's at the post, and it's gone out for a goal kick. Oh, to Mings. To Lita. Lita, smack it. It's 2-1, Barnsley. Get in. A double for Lita today. An assist from Mings. We're in the lead before half-time. A fantastic uh, goal here. Well worked. Lita just smacks it straight at the keeper, and it goes through him for a 2-1 lead. Let's see this. Oh, the keeper pretty much gets out of the way. <laughs> oh, well, I can't complain. Oh, shit. What's Craney doing? He's basically helped him here. Oh, big header goes straight over the bar. Miles over the bar. Oh, shit. Opportunity here for Wigan. The redhead. Oh, oh, that would have been amazing. Matter-esque there. That would have been an incredible goal, and that would have mattered. Oh, oh, just wide. They tell you what, we're going to have been all over me the second half so far. Oh, shit. They're, on, they're in the box again. Oh, this is going to... Oh, my God. What the fuck is going on? Great. Here we go. Here comes the last-minute cheese where it ends 2-all, like fucking always, or not. 
There we go. 2-1 win for Barnsley. The second half was pretty much all Wigan, uh, but they didn't really do a whole lot. And the match ends 2-1 to Barnsley. Get in. Look at that, guys. For the first time in the season, we are in the top six. We are one point behind Sheffield Wednesday, and we are level on points with Bournemouth, but we are... What, what is it, like 13 goals above them in goal difference? We're doing really well at the moment, guys. We've only lost four matches. That is as many as... Uh, only Hull City have lost a, a, as few matches as, as us. So we're doing extremely well, because Hull City are clearly doing well. They're first place in the, in the league. Um, we're, we're very good at not losing. Let's just say that. We received 57k from the, the FA Cup. That's actually more than you'd think for us. Um, let's have a look at this transfer off for, for Leroy to 350k that's simply not enough is it let's be honest um i want 600 for lita if you can give me 600 i'll consider it oh they, they're, they're offering 425k i want 550 then 550 please well our next match is against blackburn rovers obviously last time we took them on they defeated us 1-0 and, uh, well, since then, I don't think they've really done anything impressive. They're actually in in the bottom four. Well, yeah, they're, they're sitting 21st, just two points above the relegation zone. Let's hopefully get some revenge here, get a victory over them, and uh, continue our run of form. Oh, my God. Sorry, I've just I've just seen um, the whole, whole City and Chelsea score. So Chelsea were 2-0 up within 10 minutes, and now in the space of two minutes in between the 26th and 28th minute, whole City are now on 2-2. This is incredible. Let's see if Hull City can actually get a win. That would be amazing and pretty good for United as well. All right, enough about um, real life football. Let's talk about this here in, in FIFA. No more Hull City and Chelsea talk. It's time to talk about Barnsley and Blackburn. Wait, wow, what the fuck? Yeah, thank you. Free kick for Barnsley early on. That was a strange situation. And this guy gets a yellow card as well. Oh my goodness. That's, didn't expect that, but I'll take it. Let's see. Songo. Is that? Okay, let's try and get that in. Come on. Come on. Oh, he's at the post. Oh. Oh, Horahan is just a master of the free kicks at the moment, isn't he? Unlucky. Oh, nicely done. Oh, Cole's been fouled there. Another free kick. Okay. That's quick. Another free kick here for, for Horahan to take care of. Can we get this one in? Oh, it's another save. Well, it's the first save, really, but hey. Oh, that's dipping. Oh, oh, fuck. Oh, it's gone wide. Oh, I tell you what. Oh, I can't believe that. Horahan's whipping a corner now. Come on, can you get find the head? Can you find the head? He can. It's hit the bar. It's hit the bar and gone. Oh, I thought that was gone. I thought that had gone out. I didn't realise. Oh, my goodness. Cole now. Oh, back to Cole. Cole, come on. Oh, it's another save. Oh, first chance for Blackburn. Are they going to score it? Of course they fucking are. Oh, Spiegel with a great save. That was their first chance the entire match, and they came very close to scoring. My goodness. Why, why wasn't I controlling the right guy? I don't know. But anyway, it's still nil-nil. Can Barnsley get a goal from this? Uh, sorry, not Barnsley. Blackburn get a goal from this set play. Mind you, we might do anyway. Whoa! Oh, are you fucking kidding me? You're fucking kidding me! Bullshit! Piss off! We've been dominant the entire fucking match. They get one attempt, their second attempt of the match, and they score it. Look at this. Nine shots, six on target. No goals. They get two shots, and they score with one of them. Fuck off. Cole, come on. Shoot. Why is that wide? Fuck off. Ten shots in one half, and we're losing. Oh, come on. Get to that, Mason. Get to it. Good lad. Come on. Get in. 1-1. One, one. Fantastic goal from the two. Lita and Mason right there. Oh, that's a, that's well deserved. We should be 3-0 up at halftime, not one all. Fucking hell. That was a great goal from those two, though. Great ball from Lita. High, and Mason makes... Oh, what a first touch. And then a nice little slot finish into the bottom corner. Mason makes it one all. Get in. Right, it's halftime. We've been utterly dominant, but it's only 1-1. One, one. See, look, 11 shots, 7 on target, and it's 2, and it's not, it's 1 all even. God damn it. Right, come on now, Flores. Okay. You can do this alone. Doesn't need anyone here. Flores. Oh. 
Coleman. Well, it was deflected, and now it's a corner. I don't think that was going in, but hey. We've got a corner now. Come on, whip one in. Get your head on it. Get your head on it. Get in! Naya Tanga, the winner, surely. Five minutes to go. We must have won this match. What a fantastic header. We've had corners all match, and finally one pays off right over the keeper's head. Naya Tanga with a fantastic header. He's not been outstanding pretty much all season. But this goal may well have just won us the match. Get in. Come on, Barnsley. There we go. Another 2-1 victory. Barnsley get the win. Fantastic. Late drama. We had 16 shots on goal and only won 2-1. We should have won 5 or 6-1 there. Unlucky. For, well, it was lucky for us in the end to get the win. But yeah, great result. We got the win. We finally got revenge over Blackburn. And we are on a roll. Seriously, I think this is five wins on the bounce. This is it just, just incredible stuff right now. So look at this. They are willing to spend 500,000 for Leroy Lisa. If we accept it, we get 830k. I might be able to get a scout for youth, youth players. And uh, we also get 10k in the wage budget. I think I might go with it. Um... Wolverhampton Wanderers won. Yeah, I think I'm going to go with that, guys. I hope you guys don't mind. It's very, I suppose it's quite controversial considering he's played so many matches. He's done very well for me as of late. But I think it's a decision that will work for me. I think if we do this, we'll have uh, room to spend money, you know, create, get a youth squad, maybe loan a player. I think this could work. Let's do it. And there he goes. Leroy Leeds has been sold for £500,000. And Kane is... Con oh, we do have Kane. I just realised. I didn't realise that before. So he's gone. And now we've gotten off for Dale Jennings. £500,000. Uh, I want £750,000 for, for Dale Jennings. Give me that and I'll let you have him. So yeah. Uh, we've sold Leeds. We do have Hemmings. You can replace him, I suppose. Uh, yeah, we do have him. So I guess we'll have him there. But Coman's going to play a lot more, I suppose. Um, but yeah, now we've got a bit more money. Uh, I guess we could do something here. Let's have a look at how what we can do in terms of getting a youth staff. Let's have a look here. Um, well, there's one here that looks pretty good for one million. I wonder if I can get one million. Um, let's have a look. Can I manage to get one million here? I can. Oh, is it worth it? I think it might be. Let's, let's get 1.1. Now let's hire a youth scout. Yeah, let's do it. I'm doing it. There we go. We've got Dan Sanders. Okay. Okay, so they, they've upped it to 600,000. If we accept, we get that. I want... I'll, I'll go to 700, but come on. That's not too much to spend on a 23-year-old 67 rated midfielder. Come on. Okay, so Dan Sanders has accepted. He, he, well, he's not accepted. He's arrived and he's ready to scout. They only want to spend 600. I will... Wait, did I... Uh, when was this? 29th. And what's the date today? Uh, oh, it's the 29th. Shit, okay. Uh, 6.50. Give me that. Give me 6.50. We've been given an international management offer from Venezuela. No thank you. That's a great offer, but I won't take it. Uh, they don't believe he's worth 650, so they've decided not to buy him. That's just great. And we're actually going to sim this match against Hull City. I'm not too fussed about the FA Cup. I just want to do well in the league. So if we lose against Hull City, then so be it. As long as we don't get any injuries, I'll be okay with that. Now let's let, watch this happen now. Watch us get so many injuries here. Please no. <laughs> here we go. And skip. Okay, no injuries. Mason got a goal, but we lost 2-1 in the end. And, uh, yeah, there we go. We're out of the FA Cup, but that's okay. I'm not too worried about that. The Football Association right, okay. Challenge Cup. So now we're in the uh, January transfer. Uh, we're on the transfer deadline day. So we've. N this is basically the end of the episode. Uh, let's. If anything pops up, then I'll let you know. But otherwise, I don't think anything's going to happen. Oh, massive news there. Matt Hummels has gone to uh, Arsenal. And, uh, well, that's pretty much it, really. Nothing else is really, really massive has happened lately. Okay, so the transfer deadline day has ended. £121 million was spent across all leagues, which is absolutely insane. Finny Bongonda is still too young to be signed up. Really annoying. We haven't been able to sign any players in this, uh, in this transfer window. We have managed to send a scout uh, looking, looking for youth talent over the next six months. Basically anyone. Um, so yeah, that's all we've got really. Uh, next match will be against Bolton on the 6th of February and we are reaching the end of the 
the season really for Barnsley. We've only got a few, so many matches left. We just got 75,000 from the FA Cup. So look at this. We've actually got uh, 19 matches to go of this season. Once that finishes, uh, will we be at Barnsley still? I don't know. But uh, let's actually have. A, I'm gonna have a look at right now. See if there's any interesting jobs open at the moment. So at the moment there is uh, Leicester, Nottingham Forest, Derby County, Millwall, Fulham, Reading, Wigan, Bournemouth. And there's the Eredivisie, and that's actually it. So nothing interesting at the moment. When something interesting pops up, I'll possibly have a look. But anyway, nothing really coming up at the moment. Adam Davis wants to have a match. I think I might actually give him one. Uh, anyway, I hope you all enjoyed this video. If you did, leave a massive thumbs up. Subscribe for more. Leave a like if you ha- oh, what, what, what did I just do? Leave a like if you enjoyed. Subscribe for more, if you haven't already. And, uh, yeah, I messed up my outro, but I'll see you all next time. Anyway, bye.